当时他就跟我讲一句话，他说：“你知道吗？我上你这个楼梯，我要有勇气的。”你可见，那种人的心态是多么沉重。一个家人有患了精神病的时候，其他的家人一辈子都要伴着走。我是陈雅丽。我是这个加拿大社区情绪健康协会的创会人，现在是这个组织的总监。这个会呢是在一九九五年创办的，当时创办之前，其实我对这个精神。健康，呃，一无所知，呃，对精神疾病更不了解，但是，在一个很突变的这个情况下，我自己发现了，原来精神健康是影响一个人的命运，影响到一个人一生。Oh, um, I've been here、um, a year and a half. 他来了以后呢，就在行政这一方面呢，帮助了我不少。这个会就是二十二年来，就是一直是这样，靠着全部的义工，所有的在来的这些都是义工。他是第一个自愿上来当理事。So I try to help, so that's why I'm joined the board. So yeah, nine years. Ah,、uh, of course, I've、uh, been in the board. Five years, and then I、uh, step off the board, but still as a county advisor for them. I think、uh, I is a、um, is kind of a、uh, sweet spirit leader. So I think、um, I think that's what、um, she admire people to come out come out and help her. Yeah, actually, emotional problems, emotional problems, every person has it. Uh, you, me, many people have it. I think this organization has a very important purpose. 他主动的，呃，付付出爱心、帮忙、有需要的人士，呃，我觉得是一个很重要的机构。我就希望。有一天，我们这个组织能够长长远远成为社会的一个力量，专门是就是我们精神健康的一个红十字会，为这些弱势的这个些这些人，我们给他们一块支撑的一个地方，他们也可以发出一点力量，来去帮助更多的人。Designed to just help each other. My understanding of、um, mental illness before was that you know people who acted weird 
and crazy. They were just that. It wasn't um, any sort of illness that caused them to act that way. But now I've come to understand that um, mental illness is not something people choose to be. They don't choose to be um, act crazy. They don't choose to have um, OCD or Parkinson. And so I came to understand us and accept them as just people with illnesses that we need to um, be mindful of. <laughs>